My name is Susan Jacko. I'm from Nepal. I'm a PhD student, uh, third year PhD student, uh, specializing in biochemistry. My research direction is um, especially toward utilizing machine learning models. So I'm trying to use machine learning models to design nanoparticles that can selectively kill cancer uh, and uh, solve um, infectious diseases. I was quite impressed like how BJ is trying to uh, look through health issues from all uh, perspectives. Um, I heard about the prenatal, in, uh, like non-invasive test, because uh, before I heard like if we need to make a test on the baby, like if they have disease or not, we need to extract like amniotic fluid, and it is quite challenging and tough, and it costs a lot. And uh, with the technique that BZ developed, we can just uh, take uh, a small amount of blood sample and check like does this baby have this uh, uh, genetic hereditary disease such as Down syndrome which can like, have huge impact on the future. We had a field visit uh, where I saw the perennial rice and perennial uh, maize grass. In my country, like, we also plant a lot of rice and maize. We just grow them and in six months we cut it and harvest it. It's just like for one time purpose. But the rice they develop here, it can sustain for like three to four years and they can harvest it again and again without doing uh, like replantation. I was interested on this. Maybe in future I can also plant this in my country. Um, actually, before coming here, I heard about BZI, especially from the Human Genome Project work, and uh, I actually want to visit it. Um, through the summer school, when I was here, I was not uh, expecting like how big the facility here. Uh, BZI is collaborating with a lot of people and putting all the researchers together. And they are doing this in a really short time period, so it was quite, I don't know, it's really crazy work.